In this video, I'm going to show you how to delete very large files using the command prompt. It's the quickest way to do that. Uh, if you have a very large folder uh, sitting on your C drive and you want to get rid of it, if you try deleting it through the file explorer, it's going to take forever. I'm talking about terabytes of data. The quickest way to delete that is using the command prompt. So I'm going to show you what commands you need to run in order to delete that. So if you open the command prompt, navigate to the folder you want to delete. In my case, I have an external drive on, connected to my computer and the name the drive is D drive. So I'm going to navigate to D drive, navigate to the folder that I want to delete. So the folder name is data. In my case, so CD data. Now, I want to show the content of that folder before I delete to make sure that what I'm deleting is what I want to delete. So that's the content of that folder. And as you can see, it's not uh, very large, but it this could be a terabyte of data. So the command to run in order to delete that is uh, DL, the delete command. And then I'm going to say force the delete. So in case there is any read only file, it's just force it, delete everything. And then I'm going to say do it quietly. Don't show me any messages. And I want to say um, delete all the subfolders, all the contents of the subfolders. And now I'm going to say delete everything. So all the files. So all the file name, all the extensions. Now, if I run that, it's going to delete and it's going to echo what's deleted on the console on here. But if I want to output that to a text file, I can add output to a text file, say C drive, deleted files txt so now if i run that it's gonna delete everything on all the subfolders it's gonna output the deleted file names you can also output nothing so i can say output now so if i run that it's gonna not gonna show me anything it's gonna just run it and delete it in this case, I'm just going to run it and show it on the console what is deleted. So if I run that command, it says uh, the file or directory is corrupted and unreadable. So in this case, it looks like I have a problem with my some of my folders that I need to fix. But that's the concept. So that's how you delete the. That's how you delete a large file using the command prompt.